Two powerful crime organizations have joined forces to control the international distribution of cocaine. Peter Arnett reports on the collaboration between the Italian mafia and a Colombian drug cartel. Milan, for centuries a center of power. The deal-making capital of Italy. La Borsa Verde, the stock market. A place where fortunes are won and lost. For centuries, financiers have gathered in Milan to buy and to sell. But now there are new buyers, new sellers, and a new product, cocaine. The Cali cartel has now sealed a contract with Italian organized crime. It is here in Milan, the financial capital of Italy, that the deals are concluded. It is here that the old mafia bonds of blood and secrecy meet with commerce. It is here the Italian mafia meets the Cali cartel. Control Central, Palermo, Sicily. The cartel is joining forces not only with the Italian mafia, but with its most notorious branch, the Cosa Nostra. Like their Colombia counterparts, the Italian bosses keep their distance from the actual drugs. Although Palermo is the headquarters of the Cosa Nostra, not a gram of cocaine passes through Sicily. Here, the Mafia controls international distribution. Here, the decisions are made. The Colombian groups are responsible for production refining and transportation of cocaine from Colombia to Europe, whereas the marketing of cocaine is controlled, absolutely controlled, by the Italian organizer of the crime. How to stop this is not so easy to answer. And no one better understands Mafia brutality and Cali efficiency than the former head of Italy's anti-Mafia agency, Gianni Di Gennaro. Five, four years ago, I went to Washington uh, in the DEA headquarters, and I received the first information and communication about uh, the system of work of the Colombian cartels. Italian police computers today are full of information about the cartel mafia connections and the huge gains cocaine has brought. We know that uh, the mafia is uh, ten times uh, uh, more powerful today than in uh, 1960. That new strength prompted major crackdowns by Italian law enforcement. But these and other publicized attacks on the Mafia have failed to deter its new ventures. The cocaine problem is our major drug problem now. Because, in fact, while heroin consumption seems to be decreasing, the consumption of cocaine is growing. Growing in places never before expected. Peter Arnett, CNN Special Assignment.